Hello again everyone, thanks for joining me, I hope you're all well. Okay, so jumping into a new game today, so this is Gold Rush, the game, and um, yeah, so it's uh, it was released in 2017 um, by Code Horizon, um, but it gets very positive uh, recent reviews, and all reviews are mostly positive. So um, yeah, I got it for £7.18. It's currently at a 73% discount on Steam um, until the 18th of December. So I thought I'd give it a try because it is um, being updated still. So yeah, I thought I'd just go for it. So let's turn that off and um, yeah, jump straight into it. So I have had a very quick go on here um, just to set up the audio and that kind of thing. And I'm not going to bother with the tutorial i'll figure it out how hard can it be <laughs> yeah so i hope you're all well I hope you're all having a good one i've been asked to play this quite a few times now and um yeah just recently i thought i might as well have another look into it and when i saw that discount I thought i might as well go for it so this is a review and possibly a series as well but let's see how we get on um right so i'll be back when it's finished loading okay here we go um so i'll skip that and i'm gonna put don't show these messages i'm just gonna exit out i can't be bothered with it right so we've got a truck and we've got 450 dollars um graphics all right right here we go um but that door just opened when i got in this side uh show controls X to start engine, okay. Uh, handbrake, here we go. Yeah, so obviously a gold mining game. Um, there's a couple of logs there, so we can't go that way, so we have to go this way. And yeah, the reason why I selected normal was because I was told the easy mode is a little bit too easy. So, uh, yeah, I was advised it against the um, easy mode. Oh, did our bonnet just open a little bit when we went over that bump? May have done. But yeah, it looks alright, doesn't it? And um, what we need to do first is um, try and get the vehicle under control. We need to go up to the bank and um, get a little parcel of land. That's the bank there. Because it says bank on the side. Right, here we go. We'll just abandon the car here. And something that I do like about this game is if you leave the handbrake off, your car just rolls off. Right, here we go. Oh. Right. So, parcels. And we need to lease this one so we can... Uh, yeah, lease it for free. And that'll get us started. Excellent. Okay. And then we need to go and get some equipment. So, I haven't played this before. Um, but ages and ages ago, I watched someone else play it. I think it may have been Scapegoat. It was a long time ago. So there's some stuff that I do know. But I am going to be learning a lot as well. That's the plate. So we need to quickly pop in here. And if I remember right, we've got a little bit of equipment at home already. Oh, and brake left off. And engine. So obviously... There is fuel and there's other stuff as well. So I think there's damage as well because when I was having a quick look, yeah, like fuel filter. So I think some of this stuff we're going to have to um, replace when it wears out. Right, so this is the shop and this is actually quite a big game, to be honest. Uh, there's lots of stuff that you can do. So this is one of the places that you can buy and there's spare parts through here as well batteries tires all sorts wave table jets but yeah it's quite a um quite a big game and i think it's got quite a massive fan base as well anyway let's um go and get the stuff that we need just to get started um so we're going to need one of these Okay, 
hopefully, if I get this, I can still use it without a pump because I don't think we're going to be able to afford a pump. Okay, so that. And then we're going to need some of these. So let's get, um, I don't know, uh, I think four. One of these. This will all make more sense when we get to our little plot of land. I might not even be able to use both of them. Extension. Um, right. Uh, what else do I need? Water pump. How much is this stuff? God, it doesn't leave us with much. So it might just be this. Yep, so it's outside. Our oh, stuff, so $49 left. Yeah, it leaves us with bugger all. <clears throat> um, I don't think we need anything to get started. I can't remember how any of this stuff works. But that's alright, we'll get there. It'll, so, yeah, if you're used to um, the experts playing... It's probably going to be quite a frustrating series, I've got to be honest. It's just going to be my approach. And I try not to watch um, YouTubers <clears throat> play the games that I'm playing. Can I put this straight in? No. Oh, yeah, you can. Um, because, obviously, I want to learn it myself. So it was a long time ago that I watched someone play this. Oh. Okay, let's get rid of this. I have changed the field of view slightly as well because I felt like it was a little bit too close. So I made that a little bit wider. Right, pick that up. Drop that there. And this one. Yeah, so we've got bugger all money. And I think that we have to pay rent or something as well. Um, there is a fizz lock on the uh, stuff in the back there. In the bed. Right, handbrake's on, but where am I actually going? This place. Okay, so... Old railway road. Cross the railway. See if we can cut through the factory. And then round there. Okay, let's go. Um... Okay, I pressed... X instead of handbrake. Right, here we go. Right, so I need to go that away. And that's the railway. So this is old railway road. Yeah, there's some monstrous equipment. And I think I got the Frankenstein DLC with it as well. Um, this is annoying all this so it means that we can get some old equipment as well which will be good okay so the loading is a little bit annoying as well got to admit okay right through here and then it was left at the end, I think. Open up the map. Yep, left at the end. So this has got controller support, but um, just for the first episode or two, I'll probably just be using um, Wazda. But um, I might look into... Whoops, crashing. I might look into seeing whether my steering wheel will work. Okay, so keep going up oh yeah there's like a tent thing that you start off with well that's not a tent is it big warehouse so maybe this isn't ours there's a fire over there is that the tent yeah that's the tent there so I vaguely remember bits of it my goodness I didn't put the handbrake on Yes, I did. But I didn't turn the engine off. Okay. Yeah, so this is our little tent. That's where we sleep. And, yeah, this is where we do the processing. 
Okay. So we've got a gold pan, a bucket, a big bowl, a tablet. Okay. Okay. I don't understand all that, so let's leave that. Um, oh yeah, we need to smelt gold as well, don't we? Yeah, it's a long time since I watched anyone play this. And then, yeah, we've got our little caravan up here. Okay, um, we don't need to do that. Yeah, so there's some really massive equipment you can get into on this game. Um, I've always been a little bit curious about this kind of um, setup. Right, I think that was the extension, so we can put them both down. Uh, let's open that. Can't open sideboard. Okay, maybe it's because that's next to it. Yeah, but in the UK, um, I might be wrong with this. I hope that I can use this without a pump, because if I can't, I've screwed everything up. Um, how am I going to get the water in there? Oh, no. Maybe I did need the other one. Or a bucket, maybe. Yeah, I think in the UK, any gold that you find, even if it's on land that you own, I don't own any land. I think it belongs to the royal family. And, I mean, because they're skin, aren't they? They need the money. Yes, so we can use that. And, yeah, it comes up with that. So, yeah, I don't think you're allowed to do gold hunting in the UK. I don't know whether we've got much of it, but... Yeah, the royal family, I, I don't know whether you know, but they're absolutely skin. I mean, yeah, they need all the money that they can get, don't they? They've got bugger all land as well. It's all us um, poor people own it all. Oh, no, we don't. No. Anyway, let's not get into that. Um, you're lucky you found the gold nugget. Yeah, I'm going to reject it. Thank you. Um, let's do this legit. Okay, so I think that's full up. And then this is full up as well. So do we just run that through there? We do. Okay. Right. So let's do that again because there's still some soil in there. And if you are um, a gold panner in the UK or whatever it's called and you do stumble across something, I won't tell anyone. Oh. Oh, we, that was a waste, that last one. Yeah, I think that's the same with um, metal detecting as well. I think any like precious metals that you find are just instantly owned by the royal family. Okay. More? Okay, so up to there. Right, so let's do this again. Yeah, so this is obviously going to be quite a learning curve for me. So, yeah, like I said, it might be quite frustrating to watch. But I'm a fairly quick learner. So, yeah, maybe if I start a series, come back in about 10 episodes. <laughs> See how I'm getting on. I'm trying to think what you do when this is all full up as well. Okay. What's that other small shovel? What's the point in that then? I don't know. Right.
Right, that's um, full up. Luck. There's nothing in there, Jolly. Well done. Yeah, so when you can get a water pump, it speeds the process up a lot because obviously you can just keep shoveling into it. But at the moment, we can't afford one. We could have got a loan, but um, I don't want to get into that. Let's do it. As if we've got terrible credit rating. Okay. I think I put too much water in there. Whoops. One more? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so where it's quite an old game, um, if I only do, yeah, a couple of episodes, it's just because, yeah, no one was um, interested, but the recent update was only in December, I think. So, uh, yeah, it's still being added to. Okay. Which is good. I hate when you find a game that you really like and then they just never update it. It's so frustrating. Because, yeah, you get kind of... You get tempted to play it again and then you start playing and you realise that there's just no extra content. There's nothing else to do. And you can only replay games so many times, can't you, until it just gets so repetitive that it's boring. Um, what just came up there? Oh, so I can put it in the bucket as well. I um, don't really see the point in that unless we're further away. So, yeah, I don't know. Um, right. It's a little bit difficult to see whether there's water in there, so I'm going to presume there isn't. And um, what happens if I add to it? Oh, sugar. Hold on, can I... So that's mud and water. No, that didn't work. I think we just lost some mud there doing that. Well, I just lost some mud. Can't blame you for everything, can I? Okay, so 40%. That's empty now. Yeah, so I was um, asked to play that other game as well. I can't remember what it's called now, but the more kind of cartoony um, mining game. Not Minecraft. Yeah, I can't remember what it's called, but... Um, yeah, it's... Uh, I don't know. I can't really find escapism playing games like that. Okay. Oh no. Where's my bucket gone now? That was weird. Okay, so I think probably we're losing stuff here. I think maybe if I just did two buckets and then filled it up again. Because <clears throat> there's lots of water just running clean on that last bucket. So I think they do three bits of soil each. But I don't know, I'm just guessing. Like I said, it's so long since I watched anyone play this. And obviously if it was scapegoat that I watched play this, I would have been just sitting there in hysterics rather than concentrating. Okay, that's that.
Oh, the bucket's empty, Johnny. Well done. Right, so let's just do two buckets in there. Pop that down. Right, so 55%. Uh, I think one more. Goodness, it's a slow process at the beginning. Um, and I don't think we'll be able to get equipment to auto feed this. Uh, I don't think we can take another one. Yes, we can. Yeah, this equipment's too small to um, be fed by another machine, I think. Right, let's wait until the water stops running before we put this next bucket in. Bucket's disappeared again. It's dropping it for some reason. I'm glad this works without the pump. Right, 68. Hey. So I messed up there, but that's all right gonna happen I'll try and get rid of that story thing in the background as well let's see whether I can get rid of that now it said that I could remove it no um in the settings here somewhere is it here head bobbin let's turn that off auto save every hour everything costs a dollar show frames um, prompts, let's turn that off. Oh my goodness. Um, digging helper. Let's just uh, try that, see what happens. Nope, it's still there, but I'll sort that out. Okay, so let me um, mess around for a bit off camera. I'll get this up to 100% and then we'll go on to the next thing. So back in just a second. Okay, so it's at 98% now. So I think what I'm going to do, so that we don't waste anything, let's um, leave it there. So if I remember right, you fill this up with water and then this, yep, goes in there and you can do two of them. So let's do the front one. Yep, so that's that done. And then let's take this bucket up to our um, tent and try and sort this out. So I, I might be making loads of mistakes, so please don't ever see what I'm doing as any kind of a guide because I'm probably going to be getting it wrong. Um... Well, I need some water, don't I? Uh, maybe I should have done this down there. Okay, let's try that. Maybe I never need to replace this water. I don't know. Right, pick that up. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Oh my goodness. Right, show controls. Move down. Um. Oh god. Okay, so let's get some water. Ah, oh, 
water in there. And then that's it, you shake it. Oh my goodness. Um, tip that out. Don't please don't tip the gold out. I can see it there. Right. Get a little bit more water in there. Oh god. I'm probably screwing this up. So yeah, honestly, never see this as a guide because I don't know what I'm doing. Oh. I think you just keep doing this until the water runs clear. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> this is a little bit scary. Because I think if it goes in this big thing at the bottom there, I think that's it done. I don't think there's any getting it back. Right, now, I seem to remember the controls for this are very wonky. So I think you press, yeah, shift. My goodness, four grams of gold. Um, that'd be all right, wouldn't it? So let's dunk it again and see what happens to the water. Right, I don't think I'm missing any. I can't see anything. So do we just tip it in there? I think we do. So let's tip it in there. Right, okay, so we got four grams of gold. On our first attempt. How do I get out of this? Exit E. Okay. So let's take this again. Oh, of course, yeah. There's two lots in there, isn't there? Um, right. So let's try this again. Let's try and speed up a little bit. Okay. Um, tip it out. Dunk it. Oh no, what am I doing? Maybe you don't have to put it to the side. Rinse that. And obviously I'm trying to do this a little bit quicker because, um, yeah, your time's important. So, yeah, you probably should be taking a lot longer doing this than I currently am. Uh, we did get quite a lot of gold there, though. Well, I think so, anyway. Maybe I should have put it in a more difficult mode. I don't know. Ugh. But yeah, if I've screwed up um, by choosing the wrong mode, let me know, because it'll just mean that next time I do it, I kind of know what I'm doing from the start. Okay. Right, so how do I separate the gold out now, then? Because it's just all going to get hidden behind that. And obviously at this point in the game I can't lose any gold. It would be a disaster. Okay. Um, right, I can't see any more gold in there. There might be, but who knows. Okay, so tip that out. Exit that mode. I can turn the control off now, I think, because I think I've learned that enough. And I'm sure that this is empty. Yeah, it is. Right, jump over there. Okay, so these ones. So water in here first. Yeah, the next episode I would have sorted out that story thing so it's not flashing. I don't care about the story. I care about making money okay that's that done pick that up same again yeah so you can do like big stuff which happens over here I I do remember this you can dig all that up yeah the reason why I thought I'd jump into this is because um, I was playing farming simulator and uh, someone said about one of the mods where you can dig for gold and stuff and uh yeah i've just always fancied doing it in real life but 
yeah. I haven't got the time or the right country. I know, obviously, this game's going to be exaggerated, the amount of money that you can make out of it. And um, what time are we at? 30 minutes already, my goodness. Um, so far, though, I'm liking it. So the controls are a little bit difficult to learn, but I'm not exactly young, so maybe it's just my age showing. God, 10 grams of gold. Another bit. 12. Okay. Oh, I didn't realise you could move that around, so that makes it easier. So, yeah, you can actually roll it around. Perfect. Okay. Um, That's not going to work, is it? Uh, oh, no. What have I done? Have I broke it? Do I just need to do that? I might have just thrown a load of gold away. I don't know. Wait. Pop that on there. And then, yeah, after this, we'll go and try and sell it. If the shop's still open. It's taken me ages, isn't it? I like the sound of the rain on the game as well. Okay, so that's almost clear. Okay, so what happens? Can I bring it a little bit closer? That might make it easier. Right, shift. No, not shift. Yeah, shift. Okay. Get them. Okay. Yep, that's all of it, I think. So, tip that out. Nice. And exit. Pop that down. And we're going to need to take that bucket. So, let's just pop that down there for now. Right, can I use any of this yet? Um, show controls. Um, It doesn't look like I can. So, I think that's something that I actually have to learn... Or something. So I could do that process all again and try and get, my goodness, another 16 grams of gold. But I'm not going to do that. I'm going to um, try and upgrade the equipment as quick as possible. So let's go sell this. And we need blacksmith, I think. Blacksmith, there we go. So... Where are we? All the way back and then right at the crossroads. Okay, let's do it. So, uh, camera's a bit weird. There we go, that's better. I hope I'm going the right way. I think I am. If not, they will just have a little experience exploration um yeah this is the right way i got really confused for a moment then okay through here yeah so i will try it with the controller and i'll try it with the steering wheel if it supports it my goodness um i i don't remember putting the handbrake on you can't drive with the handbrake, so I'm not quite sure what happened there. I might have accidentally tapped it. Auto save or something. Or auto load. No, it's not auto save. Auto saves every hour. I remember seeing that on the settings. I did see fast travel points as well. So once 
I've gone around the map a few times. I'll be using the um, kind of teleport system. But for now, we might as well just explore it a bit. Because I am doing this as a review as well. Okay, that's the blacksmith there. Whoops. And there probably is damage to this truck, so I need to be a little bit more careful, really, don't I? Right, how's this work? Oh, there's a motorbike there. Yes, please. I drove one of these mega years ago, a two-stroke. And I think it was 250cc or something. My goodness, that thing was rapid. Um, right, what's going on here then? Smelt. Gold losses. Okay. Um, right, I take it we haven't got any of that. Upgrade. Right, so it's this one we need. Oh my goodness, look at that. Um, okay, so I know I probably should be smelting instead, but I want to get that water pump. So let's um, do that for now. Yep. Okay, so 338. I can't remember how much the water pump is. Um... Because then that will just speed up the process. Right, handbrake off. And we can get out here. Yeah, if I can speed up the process, then I can keep, um, yeah, the soil topped up. And just get on with other stuff. Police station there, look. And a load of presents. Right, for some reason... The brakes weren't working then, and the engine cut off. Um, I think we've gone the wrong way. Yeah, it's here, isn't it? No, it's not. Oh my goodness, Jolly, you're lost. It's further up here. Yeah, I might have to change the controls, because if that is me pressing them by accident, then it means that they're in the wrong place, isn't it? For me. For an idiot. Okay, so let's go and have a look see how much that water pump is. And I think it's a diesel water pump. We can't afford a generator. 302, no, it's too much for our money. Right, small diesel water pump. 201. Okay, so let's have one of these. Fuel consumption, one litre an hour. Okay, and then we're going to need some pipes for it. My goodness, how does all this work then? Um, do I need small pipes? Let's have a look around the back quickly. Oh my goodness. No, it's big pipes by the looks of it then. Okay. That water hose, thin water hose. Oh no, I don't know what I need. I really don't know what I need. So let's um let's buy that so that I know that it's out there. And I suppose anything that I get that I don't need we will definitely need one of these. Um, I can just use in the future, can't I? Um, so it looks like that connection. So let's try one of them. That's 40. My goodness. And one of these. I don't know. That's all electronics. 85. Right, leaving us $52. Oh my. Oh no, look out. It's the big pipe. So I bought the wrong one. One out of 50 metres. A 
okay this is a little bit confusing i really should be um looking through that guide shouldn't i um okay right back in a moment okay by the looks of it i just fluked it so i did actually get it right so this is the equipment that we need according to well at least my interpretation of the guide so what we need to do now is we need to go and find the petrol station which i believe is this way and we need to fuel up that jerry can did i pick the jerry can up oh no jolly yes i did okay yeah, we need to fill the jerry can up. Um, we might as well put the rest of the fuel in the truck. So we'll spend that $52 on fuel now. So how does this work? Um, oh, Johnny, stop doing it. And brake. Engine off. Stop being a fool. I'm not doing that on purpose. Okay. Right. So, do I need to open that? Yep. Open. Use. And fill it right up. My goodness. Can we even afford that? Nope. Okay. And then $6 in the truck then. Whoops. Um, I'm really scared about that. Getting knocked over. My goodness. Okay. Right, so let's do the... Oh, it was already done up. Okay, so let's close that. Um, So we've got one dollar left. Doing great. But yeah, like I said, I'm learning it. So this isn't a guide. I think we've got lights. Yeah, L. There we go. Cool, that sounds a little bit... Halloween, doesn't it? Um, okay. Right, we're going up here. Nice. Get rid of that little bollard thing. Oh, I hope I've got the water right. Oh, that one didn't go. I didn't do that on purpose, by the way. I was completely out of control. Just like most of the rest of the time yeah i definitely need to use controller it's um a little bit twitchy on worcester but i'm not very good on um worcester driving so maybe that's just me and obviously yeah so this is going to be a bit of a re review on the game and where i paid for it myself it couldn't be more genuine so all of my reviews are genuine none of them are sponsored or anything like that i'm not paid to play them and I'm not told to say certain things I can say what I like <clears throat> okay so yeah we'll try and get this set up and if it's working and um, we'll end the episode there and yeah I'll do a little bit off camera and then in the next one hopefully I've kind of learned what I'm doing a little bit more Right. Uh, I should probably turn the lights off as well, seeing as I've seen that there's a battery in there. Um, okay, so pick up. And we need to put it this side. Um, I think it said that it's got 20% of the tank full. Yeah, nice. Right, so what have we got? Out. So in, and then what, just pop that there, that's how it works, yeah that's gone green, okay, and then this one, nice, okay, and what on there, is that it? Okay, how, how do I switch it on? Yep. 
Oh, nice. Look at that. It's, it's doing it. Okay, so now... I can just be doing this. Did I put the things back in? I didn't. Right, you're a fool, Johnny. Quickly turn it off. Okay, well, that's one way of turning it off, isn't it? Yeah, I haven't got the mats in. Yes, I have. Look at Johnny go. Okay. Yes, I don't know how you turn it off. But that's alright. Much faster process. Come on. Right, sometimes it sounds like it's done it, but it hasn't. And we're getting a little bit far away now, aren't we? Right, 10%. My goodness, I can't keep up. Need a bigger shovel. So I wonder if we can get another extension then so we can do three. I don't know. And I wonder if the best stuff is in the first bit rather than the ex uh, extension. Who bloody knows? Yeah, like I said, I don't know much about this game because it's been so long since I watched anyone play it. Okay. Right, and I'm gonna um, I'm gonna stop it here because. Yeah, I can't keep up. So I think what I'll probably do is load this up. Maybe even do a few buckets of soil work. And then it might make it easier. Because obviously we're wasting a lot of water. Anyway, right. So I suppose I'd best um, bring the episode to an end as well. Nice. So, yeah, this has been Gold Rush, the game with... Um, yeah, all the expansion packs and thing. Obviously, we haven't seen any of the expansion pack stuff as far as I'm aware yet. But, um, yeah, so if you've liked this and you'd like me to do a series, please do let me know. And, um, yeah, I don't often ask, but obviously the thumb button does really help. So if you'd like to see more, um, obviously it's free to do that. And, um, yeah, it will let the algorithm know that people are enjoying it and it will help, yeah get a few more views anyway right so thanks for watching everyone really do appreciate each and every view and if you've liked this hopefully i'll see you in the next one so cheers everyone and bye for now